Hey YouTube. Uh, so I can't sleep. And I haven't been sleeping in the last couple days. So tonight I was laying there kind of staring off into space and I was like, you know, what the hell is wrong? Why am I so upset? Why have I been upset, you know, since Friday? It's not like me. So, it kind of hit me, and I'm kind of glad Father's Day is over because I didn't, I'm glad I didn't post this during all the tributes to dad because it's probably not a very good Father's Day tribute but Father's Day just really pissed me off <laughs> um, I lost my dad well, he was my stepfather. I lost him six years ago to suicide. And I've mentioned that on here quite a bit. And I haven't spoken to my real dad since I was, I want to say, 20 years old, so it's been about 10 years since I've spoken to him. And every, and what got me was everybody, you know, talking about what great fathers they had and how much they love them. And I, I, I try my best to and I've said before, you know, I, I, I don't hate anyone, but I really, really dislike my real father. I can't even, I, I mean, if he called me today, which he won't, I can't even say that I would pick up the phone or that I would return the call, or really even, no, that's that's not true. I, I, I would give it a thought, and I would be upset, and I would care, but I wouldn't respond. And so I was a little, um, a little emo all weekend. <laughs> Emo Jen. There we go. And then I'm sitting in bed and I'm, I'm looking up and I'm looking at a picture of my stepdad that my mom gave me when I moved in. And I just had this realization that how freaking wrong I was. I mean, I was sitting around all weekend yesterday, today, you know, now it's, you know, it's Wednesday morning, and I was all, you know, oh no, my, you know, real dad is an asshole, and I can't s fucking stand him, and I completely missed the point that I have a dad, I'm, he may not be around anymore, you know, but that was my stepdad. And that maybe I shouldn't have been so judgmental, and maybe I'm not such a great person after all, that I was jealous and envious about the people who did have someone. Because at one point, you know, I was one of those people.
everywhere I went, it was, oh, this is, this is my dad, this is, you know, this is Gino, he's, you know, he's been more of a dad than anyone ever, blah, 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 he was great, you know, leaping tall buildings in a single bound, and, you know, I mean, and I'm just, I'm missing him quite a bit, <laughs> and it just seems like, you know, as much as against all these, you know, bullshit Hallmark holidays and how unsentimental I try to be that it just comes right back there and bites you in the ass. <laughs> I feel like Scrooge. You know, I was all Father's Day. Father's Day. Everybody can bite me. You know, and now here I am, you know. Still a little upset. I mean, that's that's gonna be time. It may be, maybe it'll take you know, I don't know, twenty years. Maybe I'll never get over it. But oh, it's just you still feel guilty because family is supposed to be family, and. It still kind of hurts that, it does hurt that my real dad wants nothing to do with me. Because I honestly don't know what I did, if I did anything. I mean, I was 20 years old, so, you know, I was, I was a good kid. I, I didn't get in trouble. I, you know, I worked constantly. I mean, I got in, you know, stupid shit, you know. I, you know, oh, shit, I bounced a check. Dad, I need to borrow 50 bucks till payday. You know, I mean, I did that kind of bullshit ever, you know. But I didn't do anything else. You know, I didn't date anybody. I, I don't know what I did. And I'm not sure it even, I'm not sure it even matters at this point. I mean, I wasn't, I wasn't always the greatest person, but a lot of that came after my real dad cut me out of his life. So, I don't know. But I did have, I did have Gino, and that's, I guess the part of Father's Day I missed is that I'm thinking, you know, people celebrating with their parents still around and, you know, yada, yada, yada. And I just, I miss the point of remembering. Remembering all the good and all the bad and all the funny frickin' things he used to do, and how much, <laughs> you know, he was, he was my superhero. And I wish that I had taken Father's Day weekend as a time to remember instead of trying to ignore and block it out. And I'm really thinking I might regret not privating this. You know, I, I don't like to I don't like to cry on cam. <laughs> so but I'm thinking I can't be the only one. I mean I just can't. So I guess, I mean, I'm not the best person to offer advice, but hopefully, 